Hello there ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Stalker Anomaly, Escape from Dripria 4.0. Now, there has been a few hot fixes over the past couple uh, couple of weeks or so. Uh, the last time I did an episode on this, I forgot to hot save, or scum save. Uh, as you can see, I'm, I've been a busy boy, I've been doing a wee bit of, uh, a wee bit of work. I've got myself a little Toz, I've got myself a Hunter, or a Vepper Hunter. Uh, I've got a few wee bits of gizmos here. I've got a sidearm. I've got a. I've got a. <laughs> I've got a survival machete. Um, but there's been lots of updates to the game, and it's been really cool to see. And yeah, we're playing it today. We are playing it today, and we're going to have a lot of fun. Um, we do have a few tasks to do. I do apologise for not showing you like how I got here, but I've basically not left Cordon. I've not left it here. Um, I've got a few missions to do for Sid. I've got the uh, the main objective to do, which is to go over and see the living legend, the old friend, and then we have to meet with Beard or Baird, whatever you want to call him. Beard. It's it's B E A R D. Beard. We'll call him Baird. Meet Baird. We basically go all the way over here, over to Zaton, and then that's us continuing the missions essentially. But we're going to do a little. Uh, we're going to do some of the side missions today, so we need to go to the uh, we need to go rescue a courier who seems to be trapped in uh, in a little place called the Garbage. Um, mobbing the mob, we need to get at least how many is that? Eleven bandit faction patches. Contract killer. We need to go take out a, a thorn and Sid's side, and we have to go here of all goddamn places, the wilderness essentially. Yeah, that's the wilderness, isn't it? Yeah, the, the wild, wild, wild territory, the wilderness. Uh, what else have we got? Recover Sid's uh, shipment, which also... There's two in the one place. Perfect. Guess where we're going? Hehe, <laughs> we're going to the garbage. This'll be fun. But, uh, I've been a busy boy. I've been doing a lot of few of uh, things on this game. I know it's still very vibrant right in the game. I know it's very vibrant, but to be honest with you, I don't really mind that. I don't. I don't actually mind it being this vibrant. It means that I can see a lot of things. It means you guys can see a lot of things. A lot of folk are on the of the opinion. Sorry, are of the opinion that everything should be dull and dark, and everything should be, you know, the color should be completely washed out from it. But the red, the red, the red forest is still very red. It's still very vibrant. Also, this thing right here. Oh, you can't see it. Let me just get a little bit closer to it. This thing right here, this thing's spooky, man. Listen to it. It's looking right at me. That's wild, that. That's really spooky. If it, if, if it actually kept moving, that would be even spookier. The anomalies in EFP 4.0 are nuts. Absolutely nuts. Right, hold on. Let me just double check my, uh, my duds right now. Food's doing okay, water's doing okay, sleep's doing okay, we're doing fine, we're doing okay. What we'll do is we'll just top up a wee bit on both. Have a wee, have a wee drink. Get a wee, uh, a wee, a wee can of battle beans, maybe? Battle beans are out. Heinz battle beans, there we go. Lovely, get that down your throat. Now, there's been a few, uh, a few fixes to some of the mods that are on this, uh, this mod pack. And, uh, I've not, I've not done a real deep dive on them. I've not really... I've not really, like, you know, I don't know what half of them do. I know, I know what most of them do. Uh, add things, add more content, add more missions and stuff like that. Add more threats, uh, make things a wee bit more unique. But a few of them, a few of them make the game a little bit tricky, just a little bit tricky. Um, but I've not really done a deep dive on them. So anybody that plays Escape from Trippy at 4.0, uh, you guys are gonna need to help me here because this it feels like a brand new game again with the. Uh, with EFP 4.0. Right. Uh, garbage is just ahead of us. That's the uh, that's the crossover over there. Uh, by the way, can I just say, this Toz? This Toz, though? Oh! Buckshot. 12 by 70. This thing's a monster. Oh, loner's having a little bit of a boring day. Well, hopefully we don't have a boring day today. Hopefully we have a, a day full of action, full of uh, possible threats and loot. I really like loot. If you don't know me, if you don't know my uh, my thing, I like to loot things. I like to take a lot of things that I'm not supposed to take and then go and sell them and get lots of rubles and get lots of money. 
and then buy things that I'm not supposed to buy because uh, sometimes I lose them. Sometimes I lose the things that I buy. I've got more important things to spend money on. I was just talking about money there. Oh. Friendly? 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 He's very high. He's very vocal. Oh. He's not friendly. Oh! Well, I traded with him. We're good. We're okay. I'll get to that bleeding injury in just a second. Come on, come around the corner. I dare you. Actually, patch up quickly. Oh, you mother! He missed. Come on, come round. Where? He's behind here, isn't he? Sorted. Problem sorted. Sorry, dude, but this is just the way it is. This is just the way it has to be. Okay, we've got a broken light, we'll take that because that's a bandit faction patch, we need one of those. That is a polymer sheet, and eh, nah, I'm not going to take any of that stuff right there. What I will do, what I will do is I'll press F2, get some of my health back. This boy got me, this boy right here got me, he got me an absolute dullion. Oh, no wonder he got me with a shotgun as well. A man with good taste, a man with good taste, except my shotgun's better. My shotgun. My shotgun's better. It's, it's, it's just good. It's just too good. Now, what I applied right there is an algae splint for hopefully my leg. No, it wasn't. It wasn't for my leg. It was for my arms. F3. F3 is my algae splint for my legs. So you notice the bottom left. There we go. Let's apply another bandage. Another algae splint. Let's see if we can get that to full. And then we press F2 to secure it. To pretty much like, get my health back. There we go. Both legs sorted out. And I'm regaining all my health as well. This is really good. This is perfect. I've learned a wee bit about the game as well. I've learned a wee bit about the uh, some of the mods that are actually kind of important. Specifically the healing side of things. Give me that plastic jar. I'll have that. Thank you very much. Right. We're going to go to the garbage. Let's go shoot some uh, fleshes. Maybe some zombies. Maybe do the objectives. Here we go. Right, the garbage. Bad guys? <gasps> friendlies! Oh, friendly people. Friendly friendlies. Oh, yes. That is fine. I like that. I like it when they guard the yeah, uh, I like it when they guard these positions. That's really really good. I don't have to worry anymore. That's a weird one, by the way. You kind of need to jump and press F on that to get to that. But hey, look! A friend! Привет, брат. Hello! That doesn't Мужик, sound... Oh, it's a snork! Yeah, I'll let you deal with that. No, 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 no! Shotgun. Oh, oh! Get away from me! Oh, there's three! There's three! I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm gonna die. I will die if I'm not careful here. Oh, come on, get that healed. Fucking hell, boys! <laughs> right, dude, you've got an MP5 in your hands. Why didn't you just open fire? God! I'm kinda I'm kinda happy that I've got all these meds on me. Otherwise I would have been dead. <laughs> would have been straight dead. Right! Medical item restoration boost improved. 
That as well, there's also skills in this game. Or at least this mod pack. Uh, if I press K, it brings up everything. So my survival is currently building right now. Medicine's at level 1, bartering's at level 2. Insanity and lockpicking, not done any of that. Mag loading, not done a lot of that. You know, done very little of it so far. Um, you know what? I'm going to press F5 here, and I'm going to scum save just in case it crashes. Uh, let's cut this bad boy open. I'll take some of that. Let me get some of you. Let's see what he's got. What I can do is I can take some of these these uh, these body parts over to uh, over to butcher. Hopefully, hopefully he buys these off of me. I'm a little bit oh nothing useful left. That's fine. Let's just uh, let's bandage up again. I don't know if I'm still bleeding or not. But if I go red again, which I don't think we are, yeah, we're fine now. We're good now. Right, let's go talk to butcher. Let's go sort butcher out. Let's see if he'll buy these snork parts off me. And let's reload the hunter. I've only got five round magazines for right now. I don't have any of the ten round magazines that everybody's kind of used to on Tarkov. Um, just, I just don't have, I just don't have, well, there you go, I just use up all my ammo. Oh! Oh! Add to load out. Hey, there we go. There we go. We've got an extra magazine on our loadout. Now, when you add things to your loadout, it Oh! You mother <laughs> You bastard! Oh, lucky I saved, eh? Yeah, lucky I saved, eh? <laughs> mother! Oh, that was that was me not paying attention. That was me not paying attention. That was my fault. I, I take ownership for that one. I was not paying attention. That was silly. Silly Billy. Silly feudal. Silly stupid bastard. Oh, you daft bugger. Right. No. Don't, 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 don't aim at me. I'm just using a machete to cut their legs off. You know? Don't point at me. There you go. Put my gun away. Chill out. Right. <clears throat> no more delays. Let's keep moving. I'm going to go right. I'm going to go around the anomalies. I'm not going to go through the anomalies. That was a stupid idea. Don't do that. If you're going to play this game, don't walk through the anomalies. It's kind of stupid. Don't do that. Don't do what I do. It's, it's dumb. Stupid. Don't do it. Right. I'm going to go to Butcher. Go sell these parts up. Um, oh, we've also got a task to do. We've got two tasks to do. And one of those tasks is actually right there. Oh, it's a shipment. Let's go get it. Now, do I see any anomalies? I don't see any anomalies. Right, there's an anomaly off to my right. I I shouldn't die here. I should be okay. I think. I think I'm okay. Right. I don't I don't remember if the uh, the shipments are actually guarded or not. I think it's just the uh, I think it's just the um, the courier that's guarded. You know the guy that's got the shipment. I think the ones where you have to go and find the shipment itself. I don't think they're actually guarded, so we just have to find a body. Oh, I think I found the body. Oh, poor boy. Can I? Uh, oh, I can. Yeah, take that. I can sell that to butcher. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is good. The machete is really good, by the way. You can actually get it when you start the game up, by the way. So, my recommendation, if you really want a good cutting tool at the start, go for the machete, the combat machete. You'll, you, you'll, you'll do good. You'll do good. Right, gimme, give gimme. Give oh, there's the shipment. Do I want to take that Mosin? I will unload this, though. Field strip. Uh, remove all. Give me the magazine. Wait. Did 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 my uh, did my screen just go bright red there? I'm not losing the place, am I? Hmm. Okay. Right. Now that we've got that shipment. In fact, what does that put us up to in terms of weight? 34 kilos, we can get a maximum of 41. Okay, that's good. Right, fully... Oh! 
Oh, my my swap mag swap um So in this uh, mod pack you can actually remove and reapply your scopes to different guns so long as they do, so long as they're matching, so long as they so long as they can actually like go on the gun that you're trying to put them on. And the keybind that I use to put the uh, to take the scope off and put it back on again is also the same button that I use for checking ammunition. Checking that I've actually got bullets in my gun. I might have to change that at some point. Might have to change that. Oh, there's a normally off to my left. See, the anomalies are so scary now. I don't know what it is. In Expedition in 3.0, they didn't feel like they were a threat, but in this game, I'm getting killed by the anomalies a lot more. Like, way, way, way more. Article unlocked. Anomalies. A whirly gig. Alright, Pooch. Just you stay there. Right, they're blind. They, they don't see me, but they can definitely hear me. There's a couple of fleshes ahead of me there, just over there. Yeah, those dogs. I don't have to worry about those dogs. I don't have to. I, I don't have to kill them. I don't have to kill the pooches. What's? Oh dear. Oh. Well, there's a first time for everything. What is that shooting though? I kind of want to know what that is. Right, I'm going to go around this anomaly. I'm going to go to the left. Stay away from that. Try and get myself uh, not killed. Oh, another one just got picked up, I think. Another one just got picked up. Another flesh just got picked up and torn to shreds. Woo! Right. Jump in here, talk to Butcher, and then what we'll do is we'll go and try and recover the courier. As soon as we get the courier, we're heading back to Cordon. I don't, I don't want to get killed here. I'm going to quickly scum save right here, just because I can, and it makes life a lot easier for me. Right, let's jump inside this carriage before we do anything else. Uh, anything, anything lying here? That's that's some shooting. That's some serious shooting. Okay, my man Butcher. Butcher, how you doing, my dude? I want to buy some gear, I want to buy some equipment. I want you to take some of this stuff. There you go, a bunch of, a bunch of legs, a bunch of legs. He'll buy some legs. What's he got, what's he got? Oh, he's got a Spaz 12. What's, oh, a, wee, a cheeky wee Remington. That's only 49,000. <laughs> 49 grand. Oof. What I will do is I will buy some of the ammo that I need for my guns, so I'm definitely going to buy these uh, Remington ballpoints. Uh, probably buy some more buckshot. I'm not going to bother with the, the armor piercing. I don't feel like I need the armor piercing. How am I doing on meds? Uh, I have five alu splints for my arms. I've not got a lot of bandages, so I'm just going to buy up those bandages. That's going to set me back about three grand. Have we got enough for my legs? I need two for my legs, and I need... No, we're good now. We're good, we're good. We'll just buy that up. Perfect. Thank you for doing business. Excellent. Right, let's go find the courier. So let's locate him first. He is there. Rescue the courier. He's over by the flea market. So, what we'll do is we'll head over to the flea market and we'll move out to the east from there. Sounds like a plan. What I might do for right now is there is a stash right here. I'm going to stash up the, um... Oh, hello. Are you having a wee, having a wee kip? Having a wee rest? Oh, good lad. Right, is, there should be a stash here, right? There should be a stash right here. Where is the stash? Oh, stash is back here. Silly me. I wasn't paying attention yet again. You'll find that. When, when when you watch these episodes that I don't pay attention a lot. Uh, I'm gonna... Can I not stash that up? Oh, I can't stash that up. That's a wee bit of a shame. Hmm. Alright. Uh, whilst I'm here, though, I'm gonna just load up my magazines. There we go. Magazines loaded. What we'll do is we'll unload the ammo from these. Just like that. 
You've got Full Metal Jacket and Hollow Point rounds. Not, 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 not overly bad rounds. Quite good rounds. Not a lot of them though, which is a wee bit of a, wee bit of an issue for me. Right. Let's get that right into my veins. Let's get that icon at the bottom left to go full blue. Deals on sausage and bread have been real shifty as of late. Or oh, real shitty. Not not really shifty. I thought they were shifty. I, I didn't even read it, it said shitty. Deals on bread and sausage have been really shitty as of late. Not much I can do about that. Not much I can do about that. Oh, no, wrong button, wrong button, wrong button. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, shit. I pressed F2 when I shouldn't have pressed F2. That was silly of me. But it does mean that we get some, uh, some free money. Get that in my bag. Right, we're going to scum save right now. Because I feel like I'm going to get interrupted by something. And I don't know what, but I've got, a, I've got a feeling. You know that way where you get a feeling in your gut like you're about to get, like, attacked from behind or you're about to get flanked or something like that? Yeah, i got that feeling right now. There's a bandit here. Hey, one of our guys spotted a dude here not far from here. There might be a more around. Bandits are killing the duty, guys? Is that a corpse? That is a corpse. Alright. If there's a corpse there, I might be able to loot it. You guys all friendly? They seem to be they seem to be on alert though. He's got a shotgun. He's got a shotgun. And he's got an AK or some of some sort. I'm gonna go have a wee look at this guy's corpse, see if I can find anything. Oh, there's quite a few. Quite a few. Oh, there's a lot of bodies here. What do we have here? Zombied? Zombified. Def definitely zombified. Definitely 100% zombified. Yeah. That sounds like a wee goat screaming. Away in the distance, like over that direction, sounds like a wee goat screaming. Right, our objective is right in front of us. We shouldn't, we shouldn't have anybody to deal with here. I say that and we end up getting attacked or something like that, I don't know. Generally there's sometimes like bandits here. Oh. Radiation poisoning, probably. Right, do we have anyone? can't tell if that's a tree. I think that is a tree. It's a birch tree. I don't see anybody overly uh, aggressive here. I don't see any defenders. I feel like I just heard something behind me there. Right. My guy, courier boy, where are you? Oh, that is convenient. Follow me. That was convenient. Right, let's get back to Cordon. I ain't sticking around here. Finally back in Cordon. That was a wee bit of a leisurely run. That not really a uh, not many uh, mutants in my way. It was actually quite clear. Surprisingly enough, for the garbage, I thought there'd be more fleshes or boars or something like that. But it was actually quite leisurely. There was absolutely nothing in my way. We just sprinted from where we were back to the crossover point, and that's us back in Cordon. At one point. At one point, I am going to blow up that helicopter. See that thing right there? I'm going to blow that up. I'll do it. 
I'll do it. At some point in this series, I will do it. I will get that helicopter. It will come down. It'll be like the scene from Black Hawk Down. I'll aim for its tail rotors and it'll just crash into the ground. <laughs> Whilst firing missiles and 30mm ga- uh, a th a No, 25mm? 20mm ga Gatling gun? As it crashes to the ground and completely decimates the area and fire. Oh, it'll be so good. It'll be so good. As, as, so as soon as I get that RPG, as soon as I get that RPG, or whatever uh, whatever uh, missile launcher I can get my hands on, that thing's coming down. I believe you can get the black box from it as well. Like you can use that and you can actually take that for a quest, I think it is. I think it's either a quest or you can trade it in and you get a lot of money. Ooh, we better lag. That's all the mutants loading in. That'll be all the mutants loading in. They're coming for me. They're coming for me. It's not great, but it's better than the rest of the zone. So obviously someday, uh... Well, that's my companion. Nicola. He's, he's, he's talking to me. To everyone who whines in chat about how hard their life is, you don't know crap. I'm allergic to dust in the zone. Allergic to dust. That man's allergic to dust in the zone. Feel... Feels bad, man. <laughs> Who would ever thought that such a view is possible even here? What view? That view? That's a nice big helicopter, though. Right, hopefully we don't have any interruptions. Hopefully we can get some, a couple of bandit patches, if possible. I'd really like to try and get a couple of those. Um... Because we do have that uh, mobbing the mob questline for Sid, and I kind of want to get that out of the way. It's kind of it's it's one that you can you don't really have a time frame for. You don't really have like a deadline for. So long as you get those bandit faction patches, you'll be you'll be dandy. You'll be happy. And you usually, I think you usually get quite a lot of money for it because you're going out your way to kill these people. Did did my companion just say he's so used to this place already? It's getting old. We've been here all of like five minutes, dude. You were supposed to come here of your own accord as well. You didn't even need me to come and protect you. Yeah, big wuss. Big woman's blouse, man. Right. I'm hoping. I forgot. I also mm. forgot to sell the um. I forgot to sell the pseudo dog or the side dog uh, meat as well, which is m my fault again. I was kind. I was kind of too focused on getting this courier out of here. Uh, I'm gonna quickly scum save here as well. For people who are like, why are you scum saving? If it wasn't apparent, I die a lot. I I I uh, I die a lot. It's uh, <laughs> it's just a common feature on this channel. It's a common feature on this series as well. If you've not watched my 3.0 series, I died a significant amount. Oh, that is a big anomaly. That is a big anomaly. The reach on that? God, okay. Sometimes there's bandits here, but I don't think they're home. It doesn't seem like they're home. What we could probably do is head over to uh, that place right there. See if we can find a couple of bandits over there. But for right now, we need to get the, uh, the stash that I'm currently carrying and the walkable stash, this plum, this fucking idiot, over to Sid so he can scald him and then I can get lots of money. I'm hoping that Sid sells a few good things. I've been buying uh, the Hunters, or sorry, the Hunter magazines from him as well as the Hunter rounds. I think uh, Butcher actually sold them to me cheaper, I'm not actually sure. I know a lot of people know Sid actually kind of rips them off because he's in the rookie village, he can charge anybody, like, an extortionate amount of money for, like, something that's maybe, like, a couple hundred rubles cheaper from a different vendor. He's such a shrewd bastard, that balding man. <laughs> Prepare for the worst ex- worst. Expect a blowout tomorrow night. Okay. So, lo so long as it's not right now, I'm happy. As long as there's no blowout, there's no emissions, there's nothing, there's nothing like that occurring right now because I don't think, even with my current stamina pool, I would be able to reach that point. 
I wouldn't be able to reach safety right now. I'd be dead. Where is that helicopter? Oh, it's over there. Hmm. Right, we're almost there. That is just the uh, the place to where we picked up the um, the what do you call it? What do you call it? What's it called? The jellyfish? The radioactive jellyfish? I'm gonna have to stop for a second because my character's a wee bit on the weighted side, and he does need his stamina back. He's kind of just vibing out. Look at him. Look at him. He's all. Is that a talker rev with a suppressor on it? Oh, that was fancy. Oh, look at you go. You needed my help. Why are you acting like James Bond, you fud? That stupid bastard made me run to get him when he can do those stupid flips with a pistol. What a loser. What a loser. Imagine needing help when you've got skills like that. What a waste. Right. This is where me and you part ways. Hey, dude. Hi, Wolf. Down we go. Sid's door is always open. Hello, Sid. How are you doing? The job is done. 18 grand. Oh. Wait a minute. Who do you belong to? Oh, escort him back to Wolf. Ah, right. Right, 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 right. I knew I should have started talking to Wolf. Hi, Wolf. Job's done. 17 grand. Right, let's see what Sid has to sell. Even though we know he's a bit of a... bit of a tight arse when it comes to money. Hello, you Mr. Balden man. How you doing? What have we got here? What have we got? What have you got in your arsenal? What the hell was that? Ah, RF receiver. Okay, I don't, I don't want one of those right now. That's a gas lamp. What else have we got? We have got... Whoa, look at the pistols! Look at all the pistols! A Fort 12, a 1911, Beretta M9, PMM, Tokarev, or TT. Titty. Uh, <laughs> sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can act like a fucking fool. I can't help it. Right. Um, how are we doing on meds? We're doing okay on meds. I'd maybe like to get that. Yeah, let's get that. I need to get. I've actually got 38 grand, surprisingly. Uh, food wise, we've only got a little bit of sausage. I'd like to get a little bit of bread and a little bit of sausage as well. You know? Get that all sorted out. Uh, we don't have much in the way of bandit patch, uh, bandit patches, so... Mm, 59 rounds. I forgot I had that many. We'll just sell up these meats here. We'll sell that. Uh, what is that? That is... That's a grooming kit. We'll just keep that with us. Um, yeah, there's not much that we can actually get here. We could... Oh, that the upgrade! D d oh, I can get I can get the drum magazine for the for the SKS. I can get the drum magazine. <laughs> um, I've got anti-rad items, so that's that's fine. Has he got any battle beans? He's got cho oh chocolate. He's got chocolate. I'll buy some chocolate. I do like chocolate. Everybody should buy some chocolate. Chocolate's good. Uh, we got cold brew, ready to drink coffee. There's what we need. Energy drinks. Lots of energy drinks. Keep that stamina way up there. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to take it. I have to take it. I can't help it. I can't help myself. Um, right, cool. Now that we're done here, uh, is there any work that you want done? No, he doesn't want any work done. Good. I didn't want to work for you anyway. Yeah, fat off. Right. Up we go. Let's go talk to Wolf. Let's see if we need to do any more quests for this chap right here. Uh, is there any work you want done? Tourist safari. Mm, 
You got anything else? Okay, we'll just have to do a tourist safari with them. Uh, I'll do it. Thanks. Bye. What I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly scum save right here as well. Right. Where is my tourist boys? Oh, they're heavy. Big boy. Oh, he's got a Toz. And he's got a Sawn-Off Toz. A Toz 34. And... Oh, he's got the same gun as me. Hey, snap. Nice. Right, let's figure out where I need to take them. Let's go on a little stuff. Oh, it's actually quite close. After this, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to start doing the main quest line, which means we have to go to the Great Swamps. But before that, we're going to go introduce these guys to Put your double barrel down. Get that gun out my face. Oh, it's getting dark as well. Maybe we shouldn't. Maybe we should retreat back to back to the rookie village, sleep off the evening, and then move towards um, move towards the great swamp at that point. Uh, what we'll also do is maybe drop down to the clear sky camp. Maybe take up a maybe take up a quest over there. Realistically, I kind of want to just get that that main quest line out of the road for right now. So let's get this tourist safari over, get back to uh, the rookie village, and then we'll move. We're already kitted out, ready to go. Ooh, I saw you. Oh, shotgun. Oh. Is he dead? Oh, it's dead, good. Ooh, that was easy. Good lads. Two guys with shotguns. That's probably the best loadout you'll ever have facing one of these damn things. Let alone two of them. Give me your meat. Don't take that out of context. Oh, he had something. What did he have? What was that? What What did you just have there? Oh, pseudo dog fur. What can I do with that? Properties. Medium mutant pelton. Effectiveness of multiple units is stackable. Repair bonus plus five. Can I put that on my belt? Oh wow, you can put the... Oh, that's so cool! Bleed control, burn resistance, electrical resistance, rupture resistance, and carry weight upped by 500 grams. That's so cool! Oh, that's cool! I never knew you could do that! Oh, that's... Oh, that's awesome. That's actually made my day. That's so cool. I know you could I know you could do that. I know you could do that like with like certain parts. But that far I've never experienced that before. I've never encountered that before on or uh, uh, Escape from Trippia. Oh, that's so cool man. I like that. That's that's put me in such a good mood. Just that one little detail, that one little thing. That's that's actually made me quite happy. Attention, I am now at Yanov Station. Don't go looking at, for me in the warehouses. Fellas, I offer you wonderful products at the lowest prices. Oh, a travelling trader, huh? Alright. Oh, we also need to talk to this lady. I'd like to ask you some questions. Right, she wants me to find a Toz. She wants 20 rounds of buckshot and she wants a Toz Hunter, which is basically just a Toz, the one that I've got but it uses uh, a very strong scope so what we'll do is we'll actually take up that uh, we'll take up that quest because I think I know where I can find it if I remember correctly I actually got it when I was playing my expedition playthrough so this should be good right uh, well your tourist safari people have done a good job and they kept me alive they did a better job than I did 16 grand there we go See you later. Right, let's go have another wee word with Sidorovich, see if he's got anything different. I don't know if my relations would have uh, improved from those missions. So let's just double let, let's just double check. Let's just double check. Let's see if he's got anything different. He doesn't seem to have anything different. However, I am very Oh, I can't take the SKS because it's 80 grand! <laughs> And it's 762 as well, and I do like 762. But I do like 762 by 5-1, which is the round for the hunter. 
I do like it. I do. I can't help it. I do like it. It's kind of good. It's just kind of good, you know. It's kind of good. Right. Jesus, you have a fat head. Right. Let's go to sleep. Yeah, let's go to sleep. Let's go for a wee. Let's go for a wee nap. Uh, before we do that, let's press F3 to get our uh, our leg fixed, and then pop one of these. Health is looking good. Let's just double check health. Let's just double check what I've actually got in terms of medical packs. Uh, we have three uses on him, two uses on him, and two uses on him. We've got ample amounts of medical supplies right now. This is perfect. Right, we're going to go for a wee nap. We're going to go for a wee sleep. And then we're heading for the Great Swamps. Nighty night, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. The crows are going absolutely batty. The crows are going absolutely apeshit. Right, let's just double check what kind of uh, what state I'm in right now. We do need a little bit of food. We do need to get some of this uh, some of this bread munched. Oh, that is well, ladies and gentlemen. If you actually stand near a campfire, uh, your health will regenerate, and it will also cure um, size sickness and radiation sickness. If I believe. I think I'm saying that right. I think I'm I think I'm reading that right. I can actually remember. We're gonna have some chocolate. Why am I going all fuzzy? What the hell? Why am I going all fuzzy? What was the need for that? That was weird. What kind of chocolate is that? Russian chocolate. Thirstiness, sleepiness. Okay. We shouldn't be that. We shouldn't we shouldn't be that bad off. Have a wee swig of water. Lovely. Double check all our stats are good. Foods have we bought? It's okay. It's not as so long as it's above like you know, seventy five percent, which it's not. Which means the uh, ah, you're pushing me into the fire, you clown. That's what that was. He just pushed me into the. Oh wait. Wait, what's that building? I, ju I just seen something building above the bottom left hand icon. What was that? Was that radiation? I better not have been radiation. Right, one more swig of water and that should be us complete. That should be us ready to go. Ready to rock and roll. Face the world, as they say. Right, sleep's full, water's full, hunger's full. Let's... No, nope, get that back out. Get that back out. Let's just close that and let's... Uh... Yeah, we'll go this way. Ooh, there's a stash over there. We might be able to grab that. Right. We're going to leave to the south. We're going to leave to the south and we're going to head through into the Great Swamps. Let's rock and roll. Ooh, you are very close, aren't you? You're very close. I need to be careful with the military guys because the if I start fighting with the military guys... Um, oh, mercenary? He's French? He's gonna give up really fast. <laughs> Sorry, I'm kidding on. I'm joking. It's a joke. It's a joke. Don't get angry at me. It's a joke. We all giggle here. It's all. It's all. It's all fun and games. You know what I mean? Oh, what are you radio? Now I do need to be a wee bit on the wary side here because sometimes there are dogs. Sometimes there's pseudo dogs and side dogs here. Just have to keep my eyes open. We've also got a dead fellow over there who usually has something on him, but I'm not going to bother uh, searching. This is the way. Let's head into the Great Swamps, ladies and gentlemen. The Great Swamps. Oh, and there's already shooting. Oh my god, all the shooting! There's so much shooting going on. I'm gonna turn off my head torch. Actually, that's a that's a good idea, Fudo. You silly bugger. Right, we've got range. Oh, we've got a lag there again. That is a lot of shooting. It's coming from the church. Right, 
Where is this, uh... Oh, there's an important character over by the church. Okay. Alright, okay. Let's head for the church. Let's move to the church. Let's see this important character. Let's see if he's actually important. He might not be important. He might be a liar. You never know, though. There is a significant amount of shooting going on right now. There must be a few factions here. Oh yeah, there must there must be a few factions here. Okay. We've got an area over there that we can overlook uh, the church. Let's head towards the trees. Let's see if we can provide some cover fire for this important character. Oh. He's close. Oh, it's a clear sky. And he's got a Mosin. Boy's good over here. Boy's good over here. You alright? You all good? Yo, give me, give, give me the, give me that bread. Give me that bread. <gasps> An item. Another item. What we got? Seven six two by five seven Mauser rounds. That's a lot. That is a stupid amount of shooting. Yo, friendly in here. Oh, hi. Oh, he's an ecologist. Hi. Ну привет. How you doing? Hello, Professor. How's how your research is going? Yes, of course. I've already a ma I already have a matter I need to help with. If you're up for it. Uh, sure. For my next experiment, I require anomalous dirt from the local anomalous fields. You need to go into these anomalous anomalies and find the most formed artifacts. Your detector should be able to pick them up to help help you search. You know what? You know what, Doc? I'll help you another time. I'll help you another time. I'll help you another time. I'm here for a... I'm here for a stash. I'm here for the stash. Oh, God, there's a... Is that a shovel? <laughs> Did I just get a shovel? Right, we're gonna save here. There we go, saved. Right, let's find out where the stash is hidden. It seems to be outside. Or is it? Oh no, is that it? Oh heck yeah it is! Light armor repair kit. Hell yeah! Nice! What's our current weight at? Oh, we're just over. We are just over. Uh, what I am going to do is I'm going to drop that bedspread and that shovel. I don't feel like carrying a shovel with me. Uh, we'll drop those magazines as well. Oh. Sounds like a lot. St there's still a lot of shooting going on. That's really, really close. Someone saw an egghead nearby. Stay alert. Oh, it's a renegade. Renegades. I forgot they're in this area. Oh, I think I see them shooting. I think I see where they're getting shot from. Fuckers killed a friend of mine. Oh, no. Oh. Okay. Okay, chill, chill, chill. Oh, that... That guy just got dropped so hard. Papa Shah, renegades. I know I, know I shouldn't be looting right now, but I can't help myself. How do you walk like that?
Yeah, so whilst they do their job, um, I'm just going to quickly loot. What the hell were they shooting at? Dogs? Were they, shoot were they shooting at those dogs? Is that a bad guy in the distance? Oh, it is too! Right, let's see if we can get him. I ran out of... <laughs> Have I not got any bullets? Have I not got any more? Oh! What the hell's just going on? Oh! I know what's going on. Guys, it's crashed. Give me two seconds. Oh, I reloaded the save. I reloaded my save and it's now raining. Nice. Thanks, game. Thanks. That's nice. Oh, he's still there. Oh, I got him! I landed that hit! No wonder this is a fucking awesome rifle! Dude, come on, you're clear sky, chill out! I think I just dropped him as well. Okay, okay, I shouldn't be allowed sniper rifles or any sort of hunting rifle in this game. <laughs> evil, evil, evil! <laughs> Let's go get lit! Let's go get some loot. Oh, I can't. I can't get loot because I'm full. Right, we'll just have to. We'll just have to pick and choose. We'll just have to pick and choose. We'll also have to deal with a couple of dogs, but that's okay. We can deal with the dogs. Let's get the shotgun ready. Shotgun is set and ready to go. That's an anomaly. Just go around the anomaly. Hello, Pooch. Hello, Pooch. Chill. 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 Just chill. Listen, I've got a toys. I'm not afraid to use it. Okay. You missed. You missed. Stupid dog. Okay, let's go get our let's go get our loot. Let's go get our loot. Why can I hear something equally terrifying? Oh wait a minute! Right, that's that's our safe location or back there's our safe location. I've got a funny feeling that we might be in about about to encounter a, a possible side storm. Uh, I'm a I'm a just F5 right here. Like, did I shoot them all the way over here? I must have done. Damn, I'm good at shooting in this game. Carry weight improved, melee improved, strength level one. Let's go. Is this the uh, is this the spookiness you guys were expecting from this game? Because it certainly feels it now. You guys think mutants hide during the rain? It's a good question. Death report. Lieutenant struck military. Killed Dama Brigand. Free stalkers. <gasps> Those bastards. Right, it's definitely over here where I killed these guys. Yeah, that's, lo that's looking right now. This is definitely looking right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pop a little energy drink. Is that him there? No, that's a dog. Oh, is that, is that the boys there? Oh, ho, 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 ho. It was a renegade as well. And he's got some stuff on him as well. Optical scope upgrade kit advanced. I can't take it. I can't take it. Wait. Oh, I can take it. I can take it. It's mine now. It's mine. Where did I drop his buddy? Where did your buddy? Where's your buddy? 
Oh my. Oh. Oh, his pockets have been picked. Oh, but his aren't. Oh, it's a Mauser. It's a car 98k. And I can't take it. I can't take it. Whoa, boys! I know I'm using my shotgun at a distance, but it's a Taz, it's got a long barrel. He's definitely hit. Whoa! Any more of you? Do you want to play games? Do you want to play? Oh! Right, boys. Another one! Lads. Oh! Right, F1. Get the heels on. We're okay. We're all right. Holy sh! Oh, hello. Got you. Right, reload. Let's restack a couple of magazines. I killed renegades, that's good. We're killing renegades, we're killing them all over the shop. Get them reloaded. Right, I think we're good now. I think we're good. Scum save. They definitely dinged me. They definitely dinged me. Quite a few times. There's quite a few here. Look at this. Oh, look at this. <laughs> what was that? What was that? I just picked up. What's that? Nah, we're not taking that. My guys, you're kind of poor. I'm not going to lie. These boys are not doing overly well when it comes to um, to gear, it seems. They seem to be very uh, lacking, is probably the better word to use. Who's that? A dog lover. Okay, well, you can keep your dog lover. Right, we're going to move. Um, going to move for here, right here. Now, this area right here is probably hoaching with mutants, possibly dogs. Just have to get on with it, I suppose. The character's currently at a weight that I don't want him to be at, which is almost at full weight. Full carry weight. Not particularly good, but we just have to endure. Doesn't seem like there's any problems here. Right, let's get the map back open. Because there is a certain direction that I need to go. I believe it's right here. This is the this is the area that I need to go. I'm hoping there's no snorks here. Or any boars. Because the boars are actually kinda tough. That's not a good sign. Corpses of dogs just strewn about the place. That's cool. Yeah, we're going the right way. We're going the right way. We're almost there. So far, it's been very, very enjoyable. This mod pack has been very enjoyable. There's only been a couple of crashes. Uh, well, we only experienced one, but I've experienced a few in the past with uh, EFP 4.0. But so far, it's amazing. If you want to get this, 
like go go to EFP 4.0 get to their discord uh, I'll provide a link to their discord I'll put that in a pinned comment below and you guys can go and play Escape from Trippia 4.0 it's excellent it uses stalker uh, stalker anomaly 1.5.2 not 1.5.1 cool huh am I in the right place I am I am I keep thinking the wind, the ambient wind, is a, is an anomaly or a, a, an emission starting up and it's making me freak out a wee bit. Right, let's get the strong uh, strong energy juice, let's get that gunned. So we just have to follow the fence here. Yeah, follow the fence. And there's the entrance right there. Now we have to just watch out for the anomalies. Which was what I was originally thinking about. Not the emission. I was originally thinking about the anomalies. Very spooky. Very windy. It's a wee bit like this in Scotland right now. Very, very, very rainy. Very, very windy. <laughs> it was blowing a gale today. Right, the anomaly field should just be up ahead of me here. Then we get to talk to the guy with the pet pseudo dog. Oh. Sounds like there might be a few baddies in that camp over there. That might be where we're going next. Hmm. But I can't get loot! I'm not allowed to loot! I don't have enough space! Right. Let's clear our visor. Right, there's an anomaly right in front of me to my left, so we're going to go to the right. Avoid possible death. There we go. We're sorted. No problem. Zero problems. I'm going to press F5 right here, just in case I walk into an anomaly. In we go. Our little pseudo dog friend should be just up to our right here behind these bushes. Wait, where's the dog? Did they take the dog away? They took the dog away! What the fuck? That's not cool. I'll take his dog away. Hello, friend. Oh, Doc. Strelok is still alive. Quite certain. Okay, thanks for the info. Will do it. See you. See you later. Right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to call it here. This has been a really fun episode. I hope you've all enjoyed it, because this has genuinely been dead fun. We've seen a lot of action. We've seen a lot of shooting. Lots of medic, like medical items used. We've been through a couple of cool little fiascos with the bandits and the renegades it's been a lot of fun but we're gonna call it there today i hope you've enjoyed it if you have leave a thumbs up on this video tell me what you think down in the comments below remember the pinned comment will have efp 4.0's discord so you can go away and get escape from Pripyat 4.0 get it installed get it played it's a lot of fun 328 mods or something like that it's got in it and it's a very very cool mod pack I hope to see all, all you guys playing it. It's a lot of fun. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, if you've been enjoying this series as well as my other series on the channel, and you've stopped... If, I can't speak today. I've been having too much fun. If you've been enjoying the series on the channel as well as the other series on the channel and you've still not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Ring the bell. You'll stay up to date with videos just like this as well as a Sunday night live stream which starts between 6 and 7 p.m. UK time. We go for about 3-4 hours playing Stalker, playing Scum, playing Chivalry or anything that takes my fancy on the evening. We usually have a lot of fun. There's loads of people in the chat. We always have a good, good time. I hope to see you there. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to call it here. Hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching and as always, I've been Mr. Feudal from The Zone. I'll see you all another time.